What's happening, YouTube, man? It's your boy Davion Flickstar back at you with another video. We finna get into Power Book 2, Book 2, Season 2, trailer. Yo, I just checked out the trailer. I just got home from work, so this is gonna be a quick review. Well, not review, it's a discussion. Quick discussion. Discussion. So now, earlier, if you've been tuning into all of my videos that I've been posting about TV series, especially about power bmf you would know that i've had a discussion i've discussed my thoughts about the teaser trailer now the trailer's here i have a bad hair day so i don't care call me dramatic whatever so let's get right into it the trailer just came out today i was at work i'm hyped for it i can't wait to see what's gonna happen like i said and so now with this trailer we get a full um outlook of what's of, of what's to come it seems like knowing power that maybe the five episodes is going to be revolving around jabari's case and the next five episodes is going to be about something completely different that's how power does so now you have kane kane is a bit you know he's a bit uh spooked at, if um as you can say he's a bit spooked he's suspicious about Jabari's death being pinned on him. I mean, he was there. Tariq was there, and um, it's gonna start bringing a whole lot of heat on the Tejada family. It's gonna inter intertwine with the business, the um, Tariq schooling. I mean, it's gonna be a shit show. And then we got, uh, again, we got bitch ass Sax. Once again, now him Sax Cooper Sax. And Davis McLean, they're now partners. So this, which leads to the opinion that McLean is going to be coming for Tariq, and with the Cooper Sacks all up in McLean's ear, just wanting wanting to get rid of want get rid of the last of the Saint family, Saint Patrick family. It's going to cause hell. It's going to be a trickle down effect. It's going to be it's going to be a shit show. Now you have Monet. Now here's one thing that's going to be interesting. Will Tariq? Keep his word and keep it thorough in a hundred to the Tejada family. Now, this, we don't know if he's going to be fully committed to them. We don't know if it's going to be some shady stuff coming along. But expect Monet to be real suspicious even more about Tariq. It's going to be some funny business because we know the little punk has some tricks up his sleeve. He's his daddy's son. So now, you got Shorty. Jabari Shorty, she, that little Trish right there, boy. There's going to be a lot of cheat clapping for her, but she is so gorgeous, man. I forgot her name. It's been a minute since I watched the book, too. But now, you got her. So, she's going to be, I've seen a little glimpse. I don't know. I don't know how accurate it is. It's starting to get hot in here. I don't know how accurate it is, but what it's seen in my naked eyes, in my perspective, that she may be hooking up with Kane. I don't know. I can kind of see from the like face facial angle, you know, the face angle. I, it may seem like that. And if she does that, then oof, man, talk about a treach. But you have the little love triangle going on. You got Fa, all the other girls. They have their love triangle. It seems like in one, it's like millisecond before the end of the trailer, you see Tariq. Tariq in between two girls between i definitely seen fa and it may have seemed like the other girl i forgot then if she's the girl that played from um everyone hates chris so all in all this seems like it's going to be an incredible season i think it's going to be it, it take it like book two is taking things to the next level now in the other power series raising canaan it's a different approach and you've heard me say how authentic it is now Book two isn't necessarily authentic as far as street stuff, but it's a good, fun, thrilling ride to watch. I mean, who? I mean, Power has always been like that. I mean, Raising Canaan is one of the most realistic Power French Power spinoffs. But not everything is supposed to be realistic. This is a fun show, good show. I'm not gonna call it great yet. It still has some seasons to go. Tariq is gonna be in over his head. I mean. Over the last few years with the original Power series, he was always able to slither his way out 
of situations. But with these, with this situation, this is the third body he's caught. And every time a body is caught, have you noticed that every time that Tariq catches a body? Poli I mean, obviously, I mean, if anyone, but it just seems like that's his storyline. Like, it becomes like a storyline with that. You know, it, it it has it elevates the story arc opposed to when Tommy or Ghost kills someone, then they just killed someone. I mean, it goes on to the next thing. It may have may cause a trickle effect, but for the next thing, that's they're moving on. With Tariq, it's going to be pretty eventful. I mean, it seems like with this season, I have a feeling that his karma is going to things is going to start catching up to him because he hasn't really had no grave real consequences. I mean. Besides losing his sister and losing his father, although he pulled the trigger, we haven't seen him in just real grave. Just, I'm talking about something that his back is against the wall. He has to come out swinging. He was always able to just make his way out. I mean, he of course, it was some times in the first season where things got hectic, but it didn't cause any anarchy as much as it seems like it's going to be in this season. So... Y'all let me know what y'all think of the trailer. I think the trailer is going to be crazy. The ser the season is going to be crazy. We're going to get a lot of surprises, a lot of plot twists, a lot of good goodies, goody goodies. Man, it's going to be great. It's power. I'm hype. I'm ready for book four. Definitely my boy Tommy. I'm waiting on season two for Raising Canaan. It's, it's just 50s doing it, man. He is like the Thanos in the drug Marvel Universe. He's just... Like, with a snap of the finger. As stars, at least. He just bringing everything together. And it's dope to see a, 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 a hip-hop artist, a black man at that, accomplish so much. Especially to be able to take over the music industry, the fashion industry, the um, the, 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 the internet, the, 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 the TV industry. It's dope. It's so, I look forward to it. Um, I look forward to the stakes being high. I look forward to him... Tariq and Kane going at it again. And let's mention, honorable mention. It seemed like Tay it seemed like Pops is out. If you know who Pops is, you know who I'm talking about. Papa Tayada. Now, I don't know what this is gonna cause. I see I seen Monet talking to someone and she seemed a little bit frantic. She seemed a bit, you know, in her feelings. She seemed like she was emotional so i'm guessing i predict that my hypothesis is my premonition is she's talking to papa teada i forgot the lorenzo teada if i'm not mistaken i mean sometimes i forget character names but that's okay with him being now this is going to take things to a whole nother level because he's the big op so Everyone got to either lay down or get down, but it's expect enemies. Expect a lot of enemies to come towards their way. And what I said earlier in this video, Tariq, I don't know. Things is going to start catching up. It's going to be a bigger challenge. He got a lot on his plate. He got to worry about not getting caught for Jabari's death. He got to worry about F.A. and the other in his love triangle. He got to worry about um, maintaining Monet's and her family's trust. And I, 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 to me, what I, what I see in my perspective, what I have a hypothesis about, he may have to prove himself to pop to Lorenzo Tejada. So you never know until you watch this series. I look forward to it, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. If y'all excited, if y'all not, y'all let me know what y'all think. But I'm out of here, man. I'm finna get some shut out, man. Y'all be easy.